welcome back to another video and today i'm going to be doing episode two of the series i'm doing of showcasing the map city living and that as we did we left off at the plaza and there's some room paper stuff here but i'm going to show you i'll show if i don't stop if i can stop messing around with this i will show you the next part of yeah the street but i will show you the next part there's some bike racks and stuff but I'm going to be reviewing the C-Mart, and a lot more stuff, but like the C-Mart. So, yeah, here's an ATM, and you see how I can't use it right now, because if I go into settings, go creative, and then all you need to do is look up card. Once you look up card, you'll see those cards, they're called platinum cards, you use those to get bank notes. And you can get different amounts of money. Like this time, sometimes you won't be able to see it, but then you walk up, you'll get it. And this time I got ten dollars, which is a pretty good amount. But and sometimes you won't. You'll get three or five. But yeah, so I'm just gonna show you the parking lot. And while I'm doing that, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And also, please subscribe to me and be watching to you. She has awesome nail art designs. You will definitely love them. So yeah. So. If you look at this, there's another rest. There's a little restaurant that has its own entrance. I'll show you where this entrance is right here. Just in case you're planning on coming to the map, it's so cute. I really like this restaurant. Um, yeah, here's some drinks. I'm just gonna show you what they do. Then you can come around here, and yeah, you can see that. And there's all the food. And I'm gonna take some food just for the the trip because I'll need some. So yeah, so here's some donuts and stuff, and yeah, so you can come through here, and now we're going to go on to where you shop. So there's actually where you shop, but I'm going to show you over here. So you just normally come through here, but I'm going to show you another area, which I would like to talk about a little bit. So this is like the self cash registers area. And here is where you would actually go through. So, if you need to get your food or something, ignore what I'm doing right now. Um, you'd come to the register. You'd see, oh yeah, if this door was open, it would be it would be an open cash register. You'd do it. You then you go and go home or whatever. But now we're going to go into the shopping. So here's some cheesy chips. Here's some frozen pizzas. As you can see here is some ice cream of all kinds. Here is some donuts. Yeah, okay. This is just kind of some aisle that make it look like your stuff, but there's really not. But it looks really nice. I like their effort that they put into it. So yeah. Here's the fish. Here's the meat, here's some melons, here's some more stuff that you can buy in your area, so yeah. Here's some poisonous potatoes, I don't know why they're poisonous. It's kind of weird, but okay, I guess. So, here's some golden carrots, and here's just some aisles, like, on the end of the aisle they show you, and that's kind of cool, but I want to show you this. This is where the stocks are and the, all the ingredients, not ingredients, products, we'll say, are stored. And then when they need more, so I come out here, and you, this is just you can a truck. So if you need to uh, unpack or pack something in the truck, that's when you do it. And then, yeah. Sorry, I wasn't really close to the mic. I don't know if you could tell, but yeah. All right, now I'm just jumping just because I think there's toilets there. Aww. Yeah. So I'm gonna go show you those toilets, the last thing in the mark, and then I will be done with this part of the video. So yeah, the female toilets and the male toilets. I think they're mixed up because look, these look like urinals, and that looks like just one stall. I don't know. This is the females. I don't know. Kinda weird, but whatever. 
and then the males don't have any urinals, so I don't know. So, yeah. I don't know what to say anymore. I'm just gonna go get some more food for the road. Now you can see this opens, comes through. I really like the realism. Like this is what a real restaurant or real store would look like. It looks kind of boring on the outside, like normal restaurant, like normal things, and then it looks really nice on the inside. So yeah, and then I want to show you this chest. I'm just gonna take a, a donut for the road. So yeah. So yeah. As you can see, there's the houses and stuff. I'll get on that in a future episode. But this is this entrance. But that's not really the entrance that you would go as a customer. So I'm going to show you the entrances that you're going as a customer. So as you can see, there's a street sign. Don't even know what that says. But yeah, here, clip. So you come in here, walk through, and yeah, you see all these little aisles. It's like a furniture or kind of, I don't know, appliance. But here's some pen cups, some lamps, some other stuff, some fruit bowls. It looks really nice. And here is a little door that you come through, and that's where we were before. This is kind of like what we had in the City Mart, where you'd have everything, really. All the stocks. I'm going to say stocks, and you know what I mean, though. So here's where the trucks would come, and load up. There's some more trucks over there at the City Mart. Um... This is all big building, so yeah. But this door, there's two doors. That door right there leads to the store right next to it. So they both kind of share the same area. So yeah. So yeah, this is where you pay. And this is like the door. So I think they did a really good job on the doors. I really like them. Here's another one of those ATMs. As you can see here, I only got $3. Normally, it's random. You could possibly get the same amount every time, but mine is random, as you saw. I don't know what that re reads, but I know... Not reads. Whatever. But I don't know what that says, but as you can see, this is lots of clothing and... Yeah, clothing. The banners. You, so you can actually buy clothing here, or you can... Oh, you can buy some banners if you want. And say they're clothing. But yeah, these are the change rooms. But they, they say... Oh, what am I talking about? At the top, you see the, like, the stocks and where all the clothing is. And then you come out here and stuff. Yeah. I don't know what to say. It's kind of just a normal little store. I really like all the realism they put into it. Like, here's the benches that you could try on shoes or something. I really like it. I'm going to show you the last, no, not the last one. The second last door on this area. Highs. Highs. with those wonderful doors. You come through. You come through here. You can see the nice flowers. And this is a furniture store. Um, there's some plants. You can see the bathroom. You can see everything, really. You can see the stove. You can see all the aisles. I really like it. And then you can see kind of like the blocks. Like, so if you're planning on building, you can use those blocks to build. And th those are kind of those things on the edge of the aisle where you can just pick up like a pack of gum or something. This is where you pay. You grab all your stuff. And then you'd walk out over here. Same doors. I really like that because I've, I've had those areas in real life where it does that, so it looks really nice. But then you come down here, and this is AIM. AIM is a really nice looking store, in my opinion. Um, this is where you pay. I normally do that at the end, but I ran it into it at the beginning. So, this one isn't really furniturized, or it doesn't have anything on the shelves. So I guess if you want to, you can try to fix it up or stuff on your own. Uh, but I really, like I already said before, I would really recommend buying these maps. They're amazing. I'm showcasing them so that you can make up your mind if you want to see it or not. But I'm just showcasing it. In the future, I'll probably do some roleplays on the map. But yeah. So here is, I don't know what I'm doing here.
but yeah, here is a little kind of cafe or restaurant. I know they like the cute restaurants they have. So yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna walk around, show you all the nice drinks. They have a root beer, fire, or water beer, I don't know. So um, they have some nice drinks here. And then here's all the food that they have. So they have some tacos, some burgers, um, some onion rings, cheesy uh, chips, fries. Then you have the kind of, okay, okay. You have the truck, same way I came in. Here's a dumpster. And here, the final area I'm going to showcase to you, the bus area. Now this is a job. So yeah, it is a job. And I'm going to showcase to you the bus and all the vehicles in the end. Probably one of the end episodes of the series. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, yeah. Here's the bus routes. Over there is the routes in the book and stuff. So you can see where you're going. It's kind of hard to see from the map. But yeah, so here is the now hiring area, bus drivers. Pink route departing 7.30 a.m. Yellow route departing 7.55 and green route departing 8.15. Here is the reason you would actually need to get money out is to you can get some stuff. And then look, wanna use a platinum card? Can't get anything. You only can use the banknotes. I don't know what these are for. I don't usually go to the terminals a lot. I don't know what you call it, wherever you guys are from. But we call it terminals. I don't know if it's called anything different. I don't know. But yeah, here's where you get your tickets or something. And yeah. So here are some little bathrooms. You come in. Here's a little bathroom. Or, well, I think it's a bathroom. I don't know. They look like bathrooms. Here's some more bathrooms. These ones actually look like the toilets in them, you know. There's some bathrooms. And yeah, here's where you can come in to the actual bussers. This is where like you do the, all the kind of calculations, calculating how much money you've earned or something like that. I don't know, I don't work there. I don't work at all. Um, so yeah, here is the bus tickets and bus spawners. So if you guys don't lose your bus or something, here's where you'd sit down and if you were working here, that's what you'd do for a role player or something. Or if you literally worked here as a bus driver. But um, yeah, that's going to wrap up this episode. If you enjoyed it, please smash the like button and subscribe to me and be watching to you. And stay tuned for the next episode. Bye.